in this video we will see the other types of research in the previous video we saw some important types of research like analytical research applied research basic research fundamental research qualitative research and quantitative research in this video we will discuss about the conceptual research empirical research action research historical research and ex post facto research first we will see about the conceptual research actually conceptual research this is a research is related to an abstract idea or theory it is adapted by thinkers and philosophers with the aim of developing a new concept or to re-examine the existing concept. Conceptual research is mainly defined as a methodology in which the research is conducted by observing and interpreting the already present information of a present topic. It does not include carrying out any practical experiments. Next research is empirical research. Empirical research is a research method that focuses on solely on aspects like observations and experience without focusing on the theory or a system and this research is also known as an experimental research it is based on the data and it can conclusions that can be confirmed or verified through the observation and experiment empirical research is mainly undertaken to determine proof that certain variables are affecting the others in particular way and we can also say that empirical research is an exper experimental research uh, realized on experience means empirical research is, re uh, is realized or the conclusion of the ex empirical research is came through the ex experience and observation next is action research action research is one of the type of an applied research in the previous video we discussed about the applied research actually applied research means when a business or the society is faced with an issue and that issue needs an immediate solution or resolution at that time applied research is used and action research is one of the type of an applied research and action research is used for the local problem it is used for improvement and research and sorry in uh, action research done by the practitioners next important type of research is historical research actually we know that history means what is happening past and the research is about the what is happening past that is called as an historical research means we can say that the research about the past it's known as an historical research there are uh, three steps of historical research we can say first is data collection third is criticism and next and last is conclusion means first researcher collected all the data related to the past or related to the historical events and then it will be criticized by the researcher and at the end the researcher come to the conclusion and researcher can use both type of data primary data and secondary data next important type is ex post facto research ex post facto research it's known as a do know the effect do for the knowing the effect means what the effect will be happen on others to know the things we do the ex post facto research means we can say that it is a study after the happening okay and it is a known as a quasi experimental research in the upcoming videos we will discuss about the process of research if you like this video please like share and subscribe thank you